How's it going, folks? It's your boy, Big Haiti, back at it again with the Sandwich Creation Saturday. Today, we're at some bread. Uh, we've got a banana here, and we've got a lemon here. We're going to make a sour banana sandwich, uh, also known as the whatever was left in the pantry sandwich. Uh, so let's, let's get started. Okay, the first step, we're going to grab a knife and a cutting board and we're going to cut up both our banana and our uh, lemon. So, we're going to peel the banana first. Um, oh, shit. If, you, if the top is too hard to cut off, we'll pull off with your hands. You can always just use a knife. It's a big handy pro tip for you. And then just slowly peel back the layers of the banana. Ooh, doesn't that look tasty? Yeah. So now, you want to take your knife and just slice it up into nice thin slices. You don't want them to be too thick because then uh, there will be too much banana. But thin slices, that's just enough thickness. Some people say that the length of the banana is the most important. Some people say that it's the thickness. Uh, me, personally, I get asked this all the time. I'm a, I'm a length guy. I like my bananas to be nice and long. That way you get um, more bang for your buck. You get lots of slices, and then you can do whatever you like with them. Here we go. We're almost finished with our banana. We get lots of little slices. Look at that. Beautiful. Okay, and now the next step is, of course, we're going to slice up the lemon. So we'll just uh, move these out of the way. And the lemon, it's going to be more difficult to slice up. Uh, we're going to try and get the skin off, and then we'll um, we'll work on slicing up the little, the, the flesh of the fruit. So... Let's get started. First we'll cut off the ends, which I'll have to use two hands to do probably, but yeah, okay. Okay, as you can see, I've just gone and sliced the ends off. So now we just have to cut um, the sides off. So I'll get, get on with that. Uh, there's our lemon. We've just uh, sliced it open like a beautiful uh, little flower. It just has opened up nicely for us. There's a seed. We want to get those seeds out. They're not going to be tasty. There you go. Um, then the next step, um, we're going to like cut it lengthwise to make little little slices of lemon to go with our um, banana. Okay, that's going to be enough. Uh, lemons, we've still got a few seeds in there. Um, you can just use a knife or fingers to just sort of dig them out. No problem. And we've got, as you can see, we've got six six slices of lemon. So we're going to um, have three fruit sandwich. That should go nicely with the banana. Now, you just want to take your slices of fruit and put them onto your bread. So here we go, one, two, three, and just try and, try and like mix it up with your um, banana and lemon, like you want even amounts of each, not too much lemon, not too much banana, just sort of nice and random, just like, just like this, just like me. Mmm, tasty. Here we go, now we'll put some banana on this one. Yeah, looks good, looks tasty. Mm. And we're just about done. We've got some extra banana. That's alright, you can always just eat it. But do, do what you like with the extra banana. And there you go. Now, next it is to put the tops in the bread. 
and you're done. And now it's time for the taste test. Here we go. Mmm. This is your sour banana sandwich. Looking good. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, it's certainly very sour. It's not too bad. Put that banana back in there. It's not too bad. It's interesting. The lemon is very strong. It's almost overpowering. Um, maybe less lemon or not lemon. Um, yeah. Here we go. Let's have another bite. Mmm. So that bite just had banana, so it was quite nice. The lemon bites are very interesting. Mmm. Mmm. It's, yeah, it's certainly quite sour. You know what? I'm gonna give this sandwich Two, two point one sandwiches out of five. Three out of ten would not recommend. Mm. You know what? That's about it for me today. I hope you enjoyed the sandwich. I hope you enjoyed uh, viewing the sandwich. Um, and whatever else. And stay tuned for. Um, I don't know. Just, yeah, go all right. See ya.